Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? And so I'm here uh, with a new haul that I wasn't planning to do. I actually got pink eye for the first first time in about seven or eight years, and that really sucked. So um, with the powder products, you can go ahead and spray alcohol on them, and that'll kill any of the germs. But with the, and you can do that actually with a lot of the cream products as well, but you can't do it with the liquid products. So um, I've been actually replacing. There's also, you know, a uh, a stream of thought that since they're your bugs and you have immunity now that they won't cause any more of a problem but I, I'm not leaning that way at this point so um, went out and replaced some staples and uh, we'll go ahead and get into it okay so uh, I started off with the L'Oreal uh, True Match in the C1 and I do also have the Super Goop Glow Oil on as well. So I have these two as far as my base. As far as the concealer, that was one of the new products that I got. Um, I have this LYS was just about gone. And so this is what I've been using while I was sick and I'm tossing it. Um, but like I said, that was just about gone anyway. Um, I picked up the L'Oreal True Match, and so I have mine in um, W1, so um, yeah, that's what I have on as far as my concealer there. As far as lips, I have the Hard Candy Coconut Caramel, and I think it's a really pretty shade. It's part of the Girl Scout collection. Hard Candy um, collaborated with the Girl Scouts of America, and... Uh, And so they went ahead and did a whole makeup collection. It's over at Walmart if you want to go ahead and check it out. I did actually also purchase a new Essence Thick and Wow and Caramel Blonde uh, for my brow. And uh, this product actually lasted a really long time. It was really nice. As far as what I went ahead and did on the cheeks today, um, I did go ahead and use the Curve Case. And this one is by Mama Mama Mitchell. And um, so this is what it looks like on the inside. It's uh, bronzers and contour on the bottom and then blushes on the top. Uh, being really fair, this is my favorite. I use it as a combo blush and contour color. And then I did go ahead and use these two as my blush today. And I did go ahead and use another of the Heart Candy and the Girl Scout collaboration. Uh, this is actually trefoils, and this is the highlighter that they went ahead and did together. Really cool packaging on this. Really like it. So this way that the highlighter works, it's a doe foot. And it's really nice and sanitary and everything. And then as far as what I did... For the mascara, again, um, had to replace, so went ahead and replaced it with the falsies, and this one is by Maybelline. So all three of these are new. They're all staple. Well, these, this is a staple item. I'm replacing this. These two I haven't tried before, and um, this one is actually brand new, so... Uh, that's what I kind of went ahead and picked up. I did get a couple of other things. I got a NYX uh, fat oil um, stick. It's not what I have on right now, but just a couple odds and ends here and there. But like I said, I was in planning to go ahead and repurchase, but because of the pink eye. Uh, the other thing that I got was the Essence, the Volume Stylist. One of these is, oh, this one is Curl and Hold. And this one is ex extension. So, um, yeah, this is what I got as well. These are the Essence ones over at Ulta. And um, like I said, I just had to replace stuff. Pink eye just isn't anything I want to mess with again. And then I did get in a brand new eyeshadow palette. I'm really excited. It actually came out during the holidays and when I went to get it it had already sold out and so the next order was going to come in right around Christmas time and I had other things going on so I came back for it later 
and it's a DD Signatures Jingle Bell Ruby. It's what I have on today. And I think it's absolutely gorgeous. The duo chromes are completely amazing here. So this is the eyeshadow palette. They also just came out with a new one that's more geared towards spring, but actually with all the greens and it being really close to St. Patrick's Day, I'm thinking St. Patrick's Day. Um, I'm also thinking that I'm still getting snow here, so anything that's going to boost my mood and make me feel better um, because I'm snowed in again and make me feel like there is going to be a green spring and summer is actually right at the top of my list right now. Um, but yeah, this is the palette and it's absolutely gorgeous. Um, what I did today was I went ahead and put this on the crease, this one on the outer corner, and all your mats are down here on the bottom. Um, I did go ahead and put this on the outer corner as well, as far as a duochrome. I put this one on the inner corner and then I went ahead and put this gold green right on the very center of the eye. And I used this one um, as an eyeliner underneath the eye as well. And I have to admit that just the duochromes alone are worth the purchase price of this palette. It's absolutely gorgeous. And um, again, I know that it was actually released for holiday release, but with these colors being so punchy and so fun and so colorful, I'm going to be using this palette during the summertime and I am really really glad I picked this up because it is gorgeous if you like color yeah this is a good one if you like green this is a good one DD signature jingle bell ruby and um, I do have some swatches here so I went ahead and swatched both arms and um, these are going to be the mats over here and then the duochromes over here again really really pretty go really, really well together. Just a well thought out palette. And, um, yeah. So, again, really happy with my purchase. And I hope they do really, really well. And um, I think probably that's the end of the video. I think that's everything that I have going on at the moment. Um, just like I said, doing a whole big restock because of the pink eye. But other than that, I think we're good and going, and I will see you later. Bye.